we, the jury, being duly impaneled and sworn, do find the defendant, Joshua Matthew Sills, not guilty of the offense of rape. A verdict coming down just after 3 o'clock. Josh Sills is found not guilty of rape and kidnapping. It's where we begin this edition of News 9 Live at 5. Thank you for joining us. I'm Jamie Baker. And I'm Dylan Cleland. News 9's Jessica Riley is live in Guernsey County with the latest tonight. Jessica. Hey, good evening, Jamie and Dylan. After a week-long trial, a verdict has been reached. The jury deliberated in just under three hours. Josh Sills has been found not guilty on both counts of rape and kidnapping. After that verdict being read, both Sills and his family visibly in a sigh of relief, his family hugging each other as well as being emotional. I spoke to his attorney, and Josh Sills did get the chance to turn to the jury and just give them a thank you. I'd like to say thank you for everything that you have done, for paying attention, doing your due diligence, and listening to the testimonies. Judge Powden, I'd like to thank you for everything you have done. I'd like to thank my family who have supported me from day one. I have done nothing wrong, and I'm glad that was proven today. He gets his life back. I, I think that he'll be on an airplane uh, tomorrow or perhaps tonight to Philadelphia and be back uh, with the Philadelphia Eagles and be able to move on with his life. And following that verdict, Attorney General Dave Yost set out a statement saying, quote, I still believe the victim, but in America, criminal convictions require proof beyond a reasonable doubt. The jury did not see it, and I thank them for doing their duty under the law, end quote. In Cambridge, Jessica Riley, News 9. I'm Gianna Dupre. Thank you for watching. Here's another video for you to watch, and please take some time to subscribe to our channel.